simple idea sparked one of Louisville's favorite and one of the largest consignment sales here. And talk about a wow. good idea, right? It's the <laughs> Kid Stuff Sale, and it opens to the general public today in Jefferson Town. Our Sam Carter has been giving us a look around at the Triple Crown Pavilion. And boy, WLKY viewers get a treat today, Sam. Yeah, we do. Absolutely. Yeah, WLKY viewers, the doors open for you an hour early. The doors open at 10 for everybody else, but still time to beat the rush here at the Triple Crown Pavilion. Now, consignment shopping is really kind of a neat thing. You you give to the store, and then when somebody buys it, you get something back. And that really is what Kid Stuff Sale is all about. It's a yes. consignment sale. And the brain behind it all I got Suzanne Decker with <laughs> Suzette Decker with me. You're Suzette, fine. you're holding some seasonal clothes there, and I want you to break I down am. better than I did how consignment shopping works and how it works here. Okay, I can do that for you. So here I have an example. These are three different seasonal outfits: in Halloween, Thanksgiving, Christmas. Oh, oh, oh. These three outfits um, actually are owned by three different people. So when you come and sell with us, you're assigned a seller number. You'll put your description and price. Each seller provides their own pricing and we take it from there. So in this example, these are actually three different sellers represented. But what I want to explain is potentially if this was your items, all three of them were your items yeah. and they sold for $24, you would earn 67% of that or approximately $16. So you could sell your daughter's bigger clothes and come right around and buy your younger son uh, two hoodies and two hats for that same $16. And with sports so, stuff especially, that's really great. Yes, it, oh yes, and boys' clothing, they go through it, they wear it hard, so it's <laughs> nice to get it uh, for a deal. But that's how it works. So you're selling and then you're buying with the same part of your family budget. And we do the work. You put the tag on and we run the sale. And kid stuff, it really, it runs through Saturday. Everything yes. that is okay to be discounted will be discounted on Saturday. But if somebody just can't make it here or they want to start selling with you guys, yes. there's opportunities for that, right? Absolutely. We have another sale in about a month in New Albany, Indiana. Registration's open right now so they can start printing their barcode tags, gathering up their winter coats and boots that no longer fit, the toys, make a little money for Christmas or spend it at the sale and you're basically just shifting that part of your budget. Absolutely. In November, we also have an online se segment of our business, which we started in 2020. How can people find that? Same thing, kidstuffsale.com. The November event is on the website. They can register. In, the, in that case, you're not bringing them to us. You're taking pictures at home. You load it to our database oh, and yeah. we, we set up the store and people shop online. So that it's local so drop-off cool. and local pickup for online. Uh, hit us with the website one more time. Kidstuffsale.com. So it's kidstuffsale.com. Yep. So you can either Just go online like that. or... Just like that. Kid is singular. Kid is Kid singular. Kid stuff sale. Kid stuff sale. <laughs> um, yeah, guys, this is a really cool event. You want to check it out. And by the way, if you're a collector or you like puzzles or games, you don't have kids, come down anyway. They got tons Good of point. stuff here, really for everybody. Coming up in the next half an hour, we're going to be taking you guys on a tour of everything we haven't showed you yet, which, by the way, is so much. There is a ton of stuff here. We're going to take you on a tour and tell you how you can save a little money on everyday stuff, Halloween stuff, shoes, you name it. We're going to tell you how to do it. Kids are expensive, Sam, and <laughs> if you can get a deal, go for it. I wish we had that bird's eye camera I know. that shows you just how much stuff there is. It's a huge place, and it is packed, so get ready to do some shopping, Sam. Thank you very much.